now that you brought up the whole situation about about the women here in Colombia, I gotta ask you, you know, because I know a lot of brothers, they they want to know about the women in Colombia, and basically, um, most of my followers, my subscribers, about 95, 98 percent male, uh -huh. so they all they really would want, like to know exactly how are the women, what's your comparison between uh, the cities that you actually dated in, and and just give us some more information details with that. Okay, okay. Well, let me um, let me say, man, I've been to 11 cities in Colombia. Um, trying to think, should I name it real quick? Cali, Bogota, Medellin, Cartagena, Turbo, Barranquilla, uh, Santa Marta, Rio Hacha, uh, Arpatado, Cali, and. Um, Another city, I'll, I'll, I'll bring it to play. But as far as the women, okay, Bogota, you know, there is a lot of, I would say, average looking women. You know what I mean? Not ugly, but just average, you know. But there's a lot of single women. I would say that's a city, um, kind of like New York City, has a lot of single women. So from a dating aspect, I think that you will have a lot of options. Um, obviously, you have to have patience in Bogota because, um, it's, it's a spread out city and it's a lot of traffic. So just dating, you know, you're gonna be waiting 30 to 45 minutes to, to to link up and things like that. And then also factor in their availability if they work a lot of stuff like that. So you're gonna to have to have a lot of patience in Bogota, you know, if you're if you're living here and you're dating. So in Medellin, um, you know, dating I would I would say it would be a little tougher because uh, you you you'll get a lot of different numbers. But, you know, they have a flake culture. And it's going to take for you conquering that woman to really um, get her to make you a priority. And then once again, you know, these women that work, they're working six days a week, usually off one day a week. And, uh, you know, they have family, social life, and friends too. So, you know, it's, it's going to take some time. And um, in my opinion, unless you get lucky, like like my, like my man's here, like I would say finding a... Uh, girlfriend in Medellin is, is very difficult. I personally wouldn't advise it, you know, especially if you're not a person that like that, that are frequent here and um, not really trying to live here. I think it's difficult. I think it's difficult in Colombia in general to date. I mean, I've been in like four different relationships. I have one stable one now. And uh, it's, you know, what I've learned is it's better to live here to find something and to find, try to find something online and visit. I mean, I, I did it, you know, I went through the, the pain and headaches, but if I was to do it all over again, I would have just focused on vacationing and waited till I got permanent in Colombia to start looking, because then you, you, you have more options then, because they, they know you're there and things like that, but, um, you know, beauty is in the eye of the beholder, so I, I won't say where it's what, but I just say I prefer women on the coast because women on the coast are more melanated and uh, you know they have more Afrocentric features. Yeah. And one thing I also want to add is that when it comes down to dating, um, the first important thing is make sure you know Spanish. Spanish is a must. Uh, I know a lot of brothers come down here and what they'll do is they try to you know find a, get a girl that well, if you're only speaking English and, and stuff like that, that's not going to work here. You got to know the culture, you got to know Spanish. Uh, that's one of the biggest things you need to know when you come here. Secondly, um, one of the best ways to find a find a girl, if, if possible, if you really if you know somebody that lives down here, and they will offer that woman to you. So those are some of the ways that you can try to find a good girl, one that's going to be um, true to you and sincere. Um, that's one of the biggest things. But those are some of the, some of the biggest things I can definitely say, which is like it's just hard. Not <laughs> many like there's so many women, but you know, it's just trying to make sure you get one that's serious. You know, that's going to take you serious. And that's the biggest question. Is she going to take you serious? Does she look at you just as a tourist that's just going to be here, fly by night? You know, so that's that's the most important factor.